welcome back to my kitchen. My name is Mindy Banks. I'm the Flip Flop Chef, and I am so excited to unbox this product with you. And this will be the first time I've seen it in person, and I can't wait to use it. So uh, if you haven't already read, I'm going to be showing you the Deluxe Coffee Machine from Pampered Chef. So I have had so many customers ask me when Pampered Chef is going to have their own coffee maker. So the wait is over. The time has come. Let's open this box together and you are going to be blown away. I already know what it looks like. I know the features. I've seen it in action um, on videos, but I can't wait to try it. So let's open this up together and we are going to have so much fun. All right. I'm going to stick this on the floor. Of course, I'm using an ice slice. I wish that we still sold these um, to open this up. So we have a coffee machine starting guide. Let's see if I can pop this out. Let's see here. There we go. So, are you guys ready? I'm so excited. Okay. Lots of parts here. I want to make sure I don't lose any on the floor. Okay. I am dying to read the comments. So normally I um, don't get this excited to read the comments, but I can't wait till this video is over so that I can see how excited all of you are. So this is the coffee maker. I'm the opening to the bag and then I'll be able to pop this out. Show you guys, this was supposed to come yesterday and I was so sad that of all five boxes that this is the one that was delayed. So it was really hard to wait. Um, all day long today I've been recording videos of the new products and I just was dying to use this. So I will be making a cup of coffee shortly, but I want to get this all opened up for you guys, let you check it out, and then I'll do another video showing you how to use it. So um, let's see. There's I love that Pampered Chef makes it easy. It says align the notch of the water tank with the right side of the coffee maker. So pop this out. So we're going to just add a notch. So that goes together there. Oops. Move it a different way. I want you guys to see the front. So attach the notch of the water tank to the right side of the coffee maker. And then are you guys ready? I don't know if you're ready. So Tell me in the comments, are you ready? Are you ready to see this? This coffee maker is not just a coffee maker. It is an espresso maker, coffee maker, and you can use K-cups in this thing. So let's look at all these different pieces that we have here. I'm so excited, so excited to try this. So because I've watched some of the videos, I kind of have a little bit of a idea of where things go and what to do with them. <clears throat> I'm not sure what this piece is, so we're gonna find out. But it has a little, this is a little shelf to hold your, um, your cup. All right, so no matter what cup you're using, if you're using a coffee mug, if you're using your Stanley mug, if you're using a Yeti, if you're using anything, it doesn't really matter. This little piece here, adjust. So however short, the shorter the cup, the higher this piece needs to be. So if you have uh, a taller cup, then you're going to put it on here. And if you're using a really tall cup, you just set it here and you don't even use this piece. So for now, I'm just going to stick this right here. This is the K cup um, adapter. And let's see, whoops, I need to turn this to where I can see here. Um, so this one is for ground coffee. I don't want to break it. Let's look at the instructions to make sure that we know what we're doing. I want to make sure I don't just jerk that out. Um, oh, let's, nope. There's a little door on the side over here. And this is where we're going to store. You just kind of tap that, press it, and it pops out. This is where you're going to store the attachments you're not using. And so this is the cake up attachment. And then this is the Nespresso pod attachment. This is what I'm most excited about is being able to make Nespresso in here. So you can use Nespresso, the traditional pods. I can't remember off the top of my head what the big fat pods are. It doesn't work with that. But we're going to store that in here when we're not using it. And let's just see here. I want to make sure that I know how to get this piece out. 
There we go. There we go. I knew that was going to be an instruction. So you, to get the little piece that holds the coffee or the espresso or cake cup on, you're going to pull up on this little lever and it pops it out. And so this one is for your ground coffee. And we have a new little filter tool that goes, or a scooping tool that you're going to be able to use for this. So let's see what this little thing right here is, because I don't know off the top of my head. Let's see. Is there... Yes, it is a syringe. I have no idea what you do with the syringe yet. So I'm gonna learn that and I'm gonna teach you guys how to use all of this. And let's see. I'll find out what that syringe is for. Um, okay, now we're into um, Spanish directions and I can't read those. So we'll see what the syringe is for. Somebody watching, I'm sure you guys are going, this is what it's for, this is what it's for. Um, but I have no idea. So I am a cold brew coffee drinker mostly, but I'm gonna be switching over to hot coffee. Um, this is just like a little, um, these are like disposable little pods. So I am so excited, cannot wait to show you guys how to use this in another video. So stay tuned for that, but let me read off the recipes that are in here because I can't wait to find out how I can use this and what different things um, I can make. So my pages are kind of stuck together. There we go. So there's tips and tricks. There's a coffee drinks cheat sheet. Um, so that's really cool. And then it has ideas on how to use three ways to use leftover coffee, making oatmeal, coffee ice cubes, coffee frosting. You've got me there. Americano coffee, a short latte, iced coffee with milk, cappuccino, cafe mocha, a dirty chai, cinnamon coffee, affogato, frozen coffee, Irish coffee, espresso martini, and then there are some other coffee complement recipes. So coffee house cookies, cinnamon pecan biscotti, mocha muffins, and I cannot wait to try all of these. So I want to know what your favorite drink is. What drinks do I need to learn how to make so that I can show you how to make them with Amber Chef Select Coffee Machine? So if this is something that you want in your kitchen, please reach out to me. I'll help you get it for free for half price, or I'd love to just sell you one if you're not interested in hosting a party. You can contact me um, on any of my sites. Anywhere you go, there will be a contact button, or you can go to theflipflopchef.com and contact me there. Be sure to also join my recipe community so that you are the first to know about specials, new products. I also have a giveaway at least once a week, every single Friday, and there are thousands of recipes there. You can find that by going to theflipflopchef.com and clicking the button at the top of the page. So can't wait to hear what you think about this, and I can't wait to use it. So I'll see you soon, guys. Bye.